coming in but this is the park bark and fly and we have a bus gonna take us in and a young man helping us out like crazy look at this guy thank you sir you're welcome all right okay so linda yeah. we are in we are oh, it says right over there tsa preset on the left okay. we are in the uh main terminal at MCO and there is the Hyatt Regency and we're going to head over here to the TSA pre because Linda did the pre right? That's right and we shouldn't have to stand in the lines we're going to see what happens we'll see you on the other side the window of this Boeing 767-300 over to Atlanta. Linda and I didn't pay a lot of attention to the seating chart. We figured two on each side, but it's actually one on each side and two in the middle. So there's Linda sitting there. <laughs> but as you can see, we have right here, you can see how the seats are. Everything's staggered. And the guy in front of me is staggered over. So that you're not actually looking over somebody. Uh, pretty interesting layout. Never seen this layout before. But then again, we don't travel in airplanes all that much. Here we are on our way. We'll be leaving Orlando soon and heading to Atlanta. Right, we're making our turn off of the taxiway. We're going to find our way to the runway. a meal and then I'm probably going to get some sleep because yes. it's my nap time. <laughs> it's nap time. Yeah, it's um, almost four o'clock. Four o'clock. Our time. It's about half an hour past my nap time. 
So uh, here we go, and we'll film maybe coming into Sacramento. Yep. So we're at the Orange Blossom Recreation Area. That is the Stanislaus River, heading down towards Oakdale. What do you say? We're getting ready to have a picnic. Yeah, that's right, that's right. This is the Orange Blossom Trail. It goes 0.5 miles, but we're not going to do that today because we're going to have a little lunch and then we're going to head on over to Jim and Hillary's. But this is the Orange Blossom Park right outside of Oakdale. I love it. All right, we're still here at the Orange Blossom Park. But look at this mural. This is way cool. And I'll tell you what's really the coolest thing about it. You see how it's just... That is the old bridge. This is, this is the new bridge. That's the old bridge. And when you turn around, you can see the old pilings and the old uh, supports for the old bridge. But there's gone. The bridge is gone. But that bulkhead is there with the uh, mural on it. There sits our rental car here in beautiful downtown Oakdale, yeah. California. And we're going to take a look. Linda snapped the picture, but we'll show you this mural right on the side of the road here. Yeah, yeah let me just back up a little. I'm going to walk out behind these cars and kind of get it. Oakdale Arts and Murals in 1992. Look at that. This is the corner of East F Street and S 3rd Avenue, California 120. We'll be heading that way right on into Yosemite later today or toward Yosemite. place look at this what a beautiful little community what a little town Linda get some pictures of the little sparrow mural this one it says by Emily Dean it's new it's from 23 holy smokes a little park here to sit around in beautiful grass look at this
right behind all of this is the hotel we stayed in. Right there is Jim's van fixing to head up to the wedding venue. Right in there is Miss Linda. You ready to ride, Clyde? I'm ready. All right, let's head up towards, what is that, Groveland? All right, here we go. All right, last time we were here, and we have been here once before, we were in the motorhome. And what, what Linda and I are talking about is you see the fence over here, and we're just looking over it. In the motorhome, you see well over it because the motor home is so nice and high and, and what a view. But at the same time, this was an effort for the motorhome. We, towing the car. We were towing the, the kayak mobile and we were coming up. There's a sign back there. We didn't, we didn't photograph it or anything, but the sign back there said, turn your air conditioners off for the next eight miles because all you're going to do is twist and turn and go uphill. And... Uh, what it's a, a steep grade. What a difference grade. this is in this little <laughs> rental car than it was in that motorhome. But I'm going to tell you what, that motorhome is a workhorse. It sure it is. It never cared. But this is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Wow. Just a different experience completely, but wow. There's Jim making the turn in the in the U-Haul. Jake ahead of us. We're heading into the hills. Look at this. <laughs> See all the bikers over here. I remember biking through this kind of stuff, but the kind of stuff we did was in the Smoky Mountains through the Dragon Tail. And lending me through the Shenandoah Valley, right? right. Yeah, leaving Washington. Fat boy. <laughs> now I don't know if we can see it, but over yonder is where we're going to be. Right. To the right. If you look way over the right, that's where we're going to be coming down. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, let's turn it off. All right, so we're coming down now. Uh, gosh, I don't know where we're at. We're about 15 miles outside on 120, outside of uh, Groveland. Groveland. But wow, the scenery is just unbelievable. Off to the left over here, and I think this is on widescreen. When we turn through here, you're gonna see this huge lake with the mountains. Come on, give me a break. So gorgeous. Oh yeah. Don Pedro Lake, Vista Point. So there it is. Take a look at Don Pedro Lake. Woo! And then the sign says that there's gonna be rocks falling on us. We don't need no rocks falling on us. last year. We sure did. We filmed it too. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. What are we talking about here? I tell you what. Alright, so we are going to see a rock slide area. Also going to see a heck of a view right up here. Ooh, look at this. Unbelievable. This is called the rim of the world. We, we took a pictures of this last year was up here and it is the rim of the world. Holy smokes. We're only a half a mile from where we're going to turn off of here to head to the venue. In a quarter mile, turn right onto Forest Route 1S13. We're about to turn on Packard. Turn right onto Forest Route 113, Packard Canyon Road. Packard Canyon Road. Here we go. The Lala Scott Lodge. Continue on Forest Route 113 for three quarters of a mile. <laughs> now we're talking. Now we're talking. <laughs> Look at the trees. Look at this place. Wow. Wow, this is gorgeous. I love this.
sky. We're still not there. We're heading up the hill. Nobody's gonna cross the party, that's for sure. No. There's the the thing where it's gonna be. Yeah, here it is. Alright, we're pulling in. Alright. Alright, we're here. Oh. Okay, so Linda, we're here. This uh -huh. is the Stanislaus Forest. Right. As you can see, it's early in the morning. I don't know, it's not early, it's seven. Yeah, seven. And, uh, but this is what it looks like. Now, what I've been told is there's fires in Oregon and, and the smoke is drifting over, causing this haze. But right down there, nestled in the woods, is where we're staying and having a wedding later on today. Look at the look at the mountains right behind it. This is crazy stuff right here. You gotta love it. It's gorgeous. Oh yeah. It's a happy day. It's a happy day. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Mm, okay. Yeah. Well, we're way up here. We walked up a little further, and we're looking down, and there is the bridge that I'm assuming is 120 that we'll be taking tomorrow into Yosemite. We're not high enough or down enough to see the water below it, but there goes a the car across it. But you can see, you can see where we're at and what we're looking at. <laughs> All right, we're walking, Linda. We're walking. We're walking in the Stanislaus Forest. <laughs> <laughs> and it's so pretty. Oh yeah. Beautiful and, September 23rd. Yeah, actually, if you look down there, that's the road that we drove in on. Right down there, heading yeah. back around. But what am I, Oh, and look at how bright. If it wasn't that little bit of haze, but I'll tell you, I don't think that's really smoke. I mean, there's, there's that haze all the time when you're looking off in a distance. You know, and that is, and that is a distance across there. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, this is coming on the property right here at the wedding venue. What you'll see off down here to the right is the little gazebo that was set up for it yesterday. This is the little house here. I'm gonna walk around the back side here. Take a look. See what this lovely place looks like here. House on the left and forest on the right. That camera has seen some stuff. And there's some of the stuff that camera's seen. <laughs> <laughs>
up. This is a wide view camera. Now we're coming through the tunnel. And when we come out of this tunnel, once again, you're going to see one of the most beautiful views, singular most beautiful views that you can see probably anywhere on the planet. Ansel Adams took photos of it years and years ago. When to get to it was a hike and a mule ride and everything else. And Teddy Roosevelt came and saw it. Take a look. Look at this. El Capitan. Yosemite National. There's someone running now, can't keep up. All right, here we go. Wow. I love this. There's a water over there. Dome. We'll see it again from the tunnel view, but yeah, it's pretty interesting. <coughs> when you twist around, you can see the same geologic features from yeah. so many different angles. And you'd swear that you're looking at the wrong place for right. there, but you've twisted around so much, and right? You ain't know where you're at. <laughs> but again, notice these huge trees. Not the giant sequoias and all that, but they are still huge compared to our Florida trees. Right. 